her before the monastery becomes a permanent outpost of hell and the way east lost forever. All right. I'll do it, Deckard Kane. Not because you asked, but because, like, I'm going to want some money for doing this. Okay, so we won't take our town portal back. We're actually going to use the, um, the waypoint, and we're going to travel to the inner cloister. So, here we go, boys and girls. This is it. Final quest of this uh, playthrough. Not really the final quest, unless we die, but this was my goal, to kill this bitch. Here we go. Find Adaril's lair in the depths of the monastery catacombs. Now, I believe she is in the depths level 4, so we've got a little bit to travel through. But, oh look, there's Bonash. Let's kill him. Okay, if we level up again, I will get another... See, look at that. That's a kind of... That's a decent amount of damage he just hits on quite a big AoE there. Because that hits all our minutes. Let's get some more points in Vitality, because I do not want to die. Um, death is so overrated. And plus the fact that if I die, probably some asshole necromancer will just revive me. Alright. It's go time. It is literally on the day. I'm just going to loot all this stuff though. Light belt. Stam potion. We'll take that stam potion. Here we go. So we now got to look for the way down. And also loot as much stuff as we can. Because to be to be fair, Deckard Cain just said kill and Ariel. He didn't say don't defile all the crypts in the monastery. Uh, monastery. So, um, you know... If you leave me an opening, I'm going to take it. Right, there's a shaman in the corner there. Right, this looks like it could be a dead end. Yeah, it's a dead end. One shaman. Stamp potion. I'll take. I'll just use a stamp potion now. Fuck it. Here we go. I'm excited. I think. I feel as if we can do it. I think we've done so well on the other stuff. Our minions. They're um. They're really kind of pulling it for us. A mace, a yellow mace, I'll take that. What's in there? Nothing. Boom. Alright, there's a lot of guys in there, that's fine. We've still got our bone armor. Let's put some amplified damage on. Alright, let's fire some more crypts. A bit of money there. Okay, so, level 2 down. Where are you? I believe it's like a stairs type thing, similar to um, in the jail. What was that? Oh shit, fuck, these dudes. These these little tiki men, rat men. Um, I don't know are they in this act, but in act three when they appear normally, they are so powerful, it's ridiculous. I'm a bit scared of them. You can hear them when they go like, and stuff. There's, there's one in here actually, you can hear. He's dead now, but... Oh, yeah, they sound like little kids. Sacred Glow. Yeah, they're just like super OP for some reason. Did I actually pick it up? Sacred Glow. Yeah, Sorceress only, but that'd be worth a nice amount of money. Oh, another champion pack. Alright, it's fine. We're going to level up from this, I think. In which case, we'll get ourselves another... Um, another Skeleton Mage. Oh, we didn't level up. Alright, well, we will when he dies. Alright, no, we won't. Fine. Fine game. Okay. So these dudes run away. Here we go, there's the level. Let's get ourselves another skeleton mage. Um, there we go. Boom. Army time. Let's get our bone armor back on. Get our amplified damage. What was that? A ring. Okay, I'll take a ring. So what what sort of mages have we got now? We've got a uh, looks like we've got two. Oh, we've got frost and a lightning one. All right. A poison one would be nice, but I think Adariel is immune to poison. So there's actually an item in um, Diablo three called Andariel's visage or visage. Um, it's a head item that gives you a chance, I think, to make an AOE poison explosion on yourself. Okay, where is our bag? Our bag? How, how big is this large axe? It's a six. Alright, we don't have the room. Let's just teleport to town. I'll be right back. Okay, let's continue. Let's pick up that large axe. Now, where is the next way down? It's a big place here. Hello? Hell Shrine? Okay. Ah, here we go. We found it. Catacombs, level two. Now, there is a waypoint on this floor, so... um. 
I should maybe pick that up if I can find it. Obviously, I'm just going to search for the uh, the way down. But if I can find the waypoint, then I'll take it. What's Stein up there? Some more of these guys. A bit of money. All right. I'm going to ignore these guys, really. As long as they leave me alone. Okay. So. Uh, oh, there's some spiders in there. Look at that disgusting spiders. Yeah. Well, that spider jelly. Pick up this gold. Alright, fuck it. I'm now so rich that I don't need to pick up every like tiny bit of gold, but there's a big pile there. I have a little bash. What's this dead end? Alright. Let's go down. Because we want to go down, so maybe the game will kind of like read us and think, okay, I'll put the stairs there. It's, it's all mind games with this game, really. Alright, so we've got some dudes. That's actually one thing, because when I'm running in to these um, these rooms, this mini-map that I've got kind of over, it does really kind of hurt my vision. Like, all, what I'm looking at more is the actual mini-map, not my character, which is kind of a bad idea. I should I should kind of play like this without it. But then it makes it so hard to remember kind of where you've been and know where's the dead end and stuff. So, But when I have this open, all I'm doing is just looking at the goddamn mini-map and thinking, okay, there's a door, run down here, there's an opening, all right, run down here. Look, all my minions are so stuck. That might end up getting me killed one day. If Andario doesn't do it. If I big this fight up with Andario so much and then, like, it's literally the easiest thing ever, then um, it's going to be a little bit kind of funny, I guess. Uh, rejuvenation, I'll take that large axe, yeah. Some more money. I can't carry oh, God damn it. How big is this? Hard leather arm, it's a six. We can take that. We just need to work it out. Oh shit, can we? There's got to be a way. Inventory Tetris. Um, fuck's sake. Alright, I'll be right back. All right, let's keep going. Crips level three or waypoint? Where are you? I'm quite impressed that we've managed to do this kind of fairly quickly, though. Um, I mean, maybe it doesn't actually take that long. I guess that's probably more accurate. And and it helps us going through those um, those extra caves and holes and stuff because um, I think that might have given us the XP we probably kind of need. All right, more spiders. That's fine. Alright, there's a bunch of guys in there. Um, I tell you what, let's get our um, let's get our bone armor back. Don't really need to be casting amplified damage so much. I don't know. What does it actually do? Damage taken on plus 100%. Okay, so that might not be bad to actually pop on Andario at least. And that probably did make the Smith fight a lot easier as well. Right, let's go down. Where are we? This looks like a big room. Nothing really in here. Some chests. Yeah, alright, nothing in there. Let's go up then. We're getting there, we're getting close. I can almost feel it now. Town of Portal, I'll take that. Won't be long, maybe. Probably will be a long but time, but... Uh. This is like a maze. Can you imagine if you lived down here? Would you Would you live down here? What would they use this space for? Like, I mean, the demons are obviously using it for all their nefarious kind of shenanigans, but before this was corrupted, what was this used for? Like, okay, here's a huge ass little corridor bit. Let's just put five candles. All right, let's level down. We found it. Um, yeah, all right, I won't look for the... Uh... Oh, you know what? I'll be right back. I'm going to look for the waypoint, so I'll just cut the video when I find it. Alright, the waypoint's in here. So now we've got it. That's nice. Now we can go back to the uh, the, the next level down. Okay. Level 3. Here we go. So when the next level is basically... Uh, and Ariel is right there. So we only need to find ourselves way, uh, through one more kind of area. Open these chests. Rejuvenation. I'll take that. We've got some zombies now. Or ghoul. 
Right. Okay, let's just run. We could probably skip a lot of these dudes, actually. And I don't really need to keep picking up all this money, either. Put some amphibian damage on them. They're dead. Cool, it's taking bloody ages. And there's another dead end. Okie dokie. So, we keep going. Not found anything yet, really. Obviously, there's only really one thing to find in here, and we've not found it, so... Amplify damage. It's getting nice using this amplify damage, actually. This is something I don't really ever remember kind of using before. Probably why my Necromancer wasn't very good. Alright, they're dead. Come on. It's gonna be close. Oh, here it is. Okay, Catacombs, level 4. we get rid of the map, because we don't need that anymore. Here we go, boys and girls. This is game time. Kill Andariel. This is our mission. Kick these barrels. Now, it's not going to be easy, I don't feel. But I'm kind of hoping that we can do it. we got we got to take ourselves... Be careful now. Since she's not in here, there's a room here that we clear. And then she's in the next room over. So, there are a lot of minions to kill in there, though, which is going to be tricky. I might have to try and see if I can do that myself. But, okay, let's get our bone armor back on. Get the amplified damage. Look at these things. And it kind of do good. Minor healing potion. I'll take that because we popped that just before we go in. Look at all these minions. That's not th these guys don't really matter. It's in it's in the room because our our damage of our minions is going to be split over all of her minions. So uh, it's going to be a real battle. And uh, and Dara has some real nice kind of poison damage. So uh, that's going to be something to kind of we need to watch out for. So here we go, boys and girls. We've made it to the door. Um, can I summon my go uh, clay golem in there? If I open the door, got him, go. And then, amplify damage. Let's get this, try and <coughs> slowly kill as many things as we can before we actually get to the bitch. So all my minions are running in, that's good, that's good. Where is Andariel? Gotta watch out for her. Open the casket. Alright, let's go down the side. You can see there's some poison coming out from there. Alright, one of the, um... There she is, okay. Amplify damage on her. She's going down, she's going down, that's not bad. She's actually going down pretty easy. You know what, she's right. Alright, that was, um... We did it! We did it! Hooray! Run! Run! I mean, what's a hooray? Oops. Goodbye. Die. This is yours. Follow me. Thanks. Run! Okay, we... Run away. Forgive me. We're gonna go with, uh... Goodbye. goodbye. We're gonna go with goodbye. Yes! Goodbye, bitches! We've done it! Right, Act 1 is basically complete, so we loot all this. So, um... Yeah, that worked out pretty well, to be fair. They got a lot of minions. They kind of did it for us. I feel as if it was easier now than it has been in the past. So I don't know if there have been like any... I don't know. It's been so long since I've played, but I do remember this being kind of really hard. Oh, she dropped us a bunch of stuff as well. An amethyst. Shipped sapphire. Shipped topaz. Okay, let's go. Let's go to town. Quest log. Return to Warif to take the caravan east. All right. Let's, um, let's identify our ship first. Let's talk to Deckard Kane. Hello. This is a great victory indeed, but many more battles await. I will accompany you on your journey, lending what assistance I can. Remember, Diablo is still out there, seeking something in the desert. I'm afraid that this nightmare will not end until you find what it is that he seeks. Okay. What are you, bitch? We have your respect now? And Dariel's death brings about renewed life for us all. We mourn the loss of our dear sisters, but at least now we can get on with our lives. I may have misjudged you, Outlander. You are a true hero. True hero. And testament to the noble spirit which has inspired our order for generations. Farewell, my friend. Okay, so it's only when I'm super like powerful she wants to be my friend. Uh, we actually lost some skeletons there, I think, maybe, so... Yeah, I guess the poison damage kind of adds up. Finally, we may rejoice. We owe you a debt we can never repay. I only hope that in time, we will be able to rebuild our order. All our thanks go with you, my <laughs> rebuild? friend. Rebuild? There's like six people alive in this whole kind of area. All right, let's... Um, did we identify that? We didn't know. All right, let's identify that stuff. Come on, Deckard Kane. Hello. 
What have we got? We got some yellows. I think they're all crap because they're not for us. That's barbarian. That's worth like nothing. Paladin. This belt. Seven to life, seven to mana. You know what? That is better. We'll take that. Old belt go away. Um, okay. So a bit of a... No, not really much of a reward there. Let's speak to Charcy, the blacksmith. Good day. Oh, you don't even care. I just killed Andario, bitch. All right. Let's talk to Geed or Greed. I think it's Greed in here, is it? Or it's Geed, no. A necromancer. I hoped I'd never have to lay my eyes on one of your kind again. <laughs> the recent troubles in this area have brought out all kinds, I see. Nevertheless, your money's good. A spare weapon, some gold, a small gem is all I want in exchange for the equipment you'll need on whatever quest you might undertake. No, 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 don't be shy. All of my items are guaranteed for life and come with a two-day warranty. Two-day warranty. Now, this guy is actually gambling. Okay. So the items he sells are identif unidentified, but they can be anything. Uh, but obviously, as you can see, they're um, generally kind of expensive as fuck, and whatever you buy is going to be kind of crap, so... Um, that's pretty much the only thing that money was sort of used for. All right, where are you? The caravan is prepared. We may now journey eastward to loot Golain. Go east. We're here. Greetings, honored traveler. I am Jaren, Lord of Loot Golain, and I bid you welcome to my fair port city. I am glad to know that once again, caravans are free to travel through the Western Pass. Yep. You're welcome. For some time now, we have been under siege by an evil power that I cannot identify. Strange, it all began when a dark wanderer came this way, looking for the tomb of Talrasha. No one knows exactly where Talrasha, Keeper of Baal, is entombed, but it is certain to be far out in the desert. Now my people whisper tales of the dead rising from their tombs, and horrible creatures lurking amongst the moonlit dunes. Even I have witnessed things which I cannot explain. I've ordered the port closed and all trade ships moored until I am sure that my city is safe. Atma, the tavern keeper, has an important mission for you. Go see her immediately. You'll find her on the other side of town. I'm not your now fucking errand monkey. The palace. I I'm here to make money. But I can't invite you in. Things are rather a mess right now. Yeah, you can say that again. All right, so we are now in Act Two. Um. I didn't actually think we would get this far. I was a little bit unsure as to whether or not we could actually do Andariel, but it seems that she was pretty easy. Um, so, the problems with this act now is that this is a very, very hard act, especially for necromancers, because um, part of the... Well, a, a lot of this area is going to be in incredibly tight spaces with monsters that are really dangerous to be near. And you, you obviously you've seen the AI of the minions, so this gets really kind of dangerous. So um, I'm going to say my new goal is to. I'm not even going to say my new goal is to get to the end of this act, because my new goal is to just like survive in one of those little uh, crappy areas. Uh, but we see. So if you enjoyed the episode, thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye. So let's go down to the. Uh, Whatever it was, the sewers. And kill some bitches. What was his name? Radamant. Radamant the dead. That's what he's going to be. I think he's dead already. I think he's like a zombie dude. Now we're in the sewers. Forgive me. Forgive me. Run. Where's my oops gone? Time to die. Time to die. Oh, I should spam this one. Where, did the, where was that for Andario? Right, so we got some... Oh, there's a champion. Run away. 